What is good, Grey Gang? Me and Adam's out here today. So, Adam, if you don't know, he is a beginning bow hunter, okay? And so he's using my old bow. We're getting him set up. But we came into a small problem, okay? He, he can only hit a target out to 10 yards. And even at that, he's shaking like a leaf. So that's when I ever realized he's not going to kill a deer with a bow. Probably not this year. So we got him a crossbow. And so I just got an Amazon. And I found one for like 200 bucks. And apparently it's a cheap crossbow, but we're going to try it anyhow. And so that's why we're going to do $200 Amazon deer hunting challenge. Because listen, this is a crossbow perfectly adequate to kill a deer. We're going to test this one out, obviously, and see how great it is in this video. But for $200, literally $200, you can get a machine that can kill a deer with the best of them. This particular one shoots at 360 feet per second. It is a compound crossbow, so it has, like, extra power and more higher technology. It comes with a scope, a detachable quiver, and lube wax, which is, like, stuff that you'll uh, fix the strings with. I'll go ahead and open it up, and then we'll start testing it on some targets. Now, the video is not sponsored by them at all. It's actually sponsored by KennelGrave1.com slash shop or first link in the description you can get this shirt right here this is one of the newest one navy animal tracks you can check it out a little bit you can see what tracks can you see there's a lot of tracks so it's kind of like a mini game just whenever you get the shirt oh yeah i got the kg's chicken socks honestly probably one of the best things on the website then of course we got the kg knife I think they're actually out of stock, though. All right, let's see. What do you think we're getting for $200? From the price we paid, we shouldn't be getting a lot. From the reviews, everyone... Oh, well, no wonder. We got to put it together. Figured that. Well, I sure didn't. We're going to be here all day. We're supposed to go hunting this evening. These are very short arrows, but we'll make them work. That ain't bad. If you're wondering why it's not complete, it is because it is not complete. All right. How do I put it together? There's instructions. I would read the instructions, but... Goodness, boys, we already about put it together. Yeah, it ain't a KG off. You can go ahead and take it out of that plastic thing. Oh yeah, that's actually perfect for crossbows because you know how you know how we have pins on the thing, right? Mm -hmm. Well, each one of those little lines is going to act as a pin. So we'll have to shoot it and test it out and see how, at what distance how far each arrow drops. All right, guys, moment of truth. Do not place thumb or fingers in flight track or you will lose them. Okay, now we're honestly probably ready to put an arrow in it. We'll shoot this one for now, just for the test shot. Then we'll put a new broadhead on it. All right, let's go shoot it. What do you think about it, Adam? If you can't kill deer with this, you got something wrong. Yeah, I'm just going to quit if I can't kill deer with it. You just have to move on to Hunter Call of the Wild. Hunter Call of the Wild. Check out my gaming channel if you want to watch me dominate and kill absolutely nothing on the game. It's kind of, it's, it's intimidating because it's a lot of power. I can promise you that if it goes off, it'll be the scariest thing ever. All right, there we got it. Well, that's a smart crossbow. It sets it on safety as soon as it cocks. That's scary, bro. How that's much tension was that? That's a lot of power. Is that supposed to be on top of there? I do not know. It doesn't look right. Mm -mm. <laughs> we didn't read the instructions. How you want to undo it? I've got an idea. No way, this ain't gonna be good. Can't even turn it on fire. It won't go on fire unless there's an arrow in it. Well, this isn't exactly going to plan. $200 challenge just turned into a $200 mistake. We need to know where those top strings go. I think we were supposed to put them down in there. Yep, they're supposed to go down there. Wait, we forgot a piece too. Okay, well, that's not good. If we can figure out how to let the trigger go off, we can fix that. Oh, how, what's your plan? Be very careful. Oh. Ready and... Then we just let it down just like before. Okay, maybe, maybe not. Okay. Okay, maybe not. Okay, we made it. It's good. Okay, so now we gotta take all that off again. Yeah, now, now. we gotta take this off. All right, this so basically, off. here's what happened, guys. We accidentally put this thing to where the strings are above this, and in the direct path of the arrow, they're actually supposed to go in the slot. I think it looks really nice. I mean, looks, of course, but how it performs, well, that's what we're about to find out. Later. All right, guys, we fixed it. We got a track in there, a little plastic piece. We're ready to go. There's really nothing that can go wrong now because we, well, we put it together the right way. But I'm just gonna say, guys, like, I'm surprised you get this kind of machinery for $200. You can't even get a good air gun for that price. Now the moment of truth. Ready? Oh my Dude, God. that's fast. Oh, that's pretty far. Our big bows don't do that, and this is a whole lot bigger arrow. All right, so you just do that, and then you pull straight up until it clicks into place. There you go. Now it's good. <laughs> it's, it's, it's stout. Act as if this is a deer. Slow motion. Let's see how we can do this. 
Dude, it's so quick. It's definitely not sided in. No, it's definitely not sided in, but we'll do that right now. Here we go, let's side it in. All right, guys, so what we're doing right now, this is like literally scary. Whenever you get about halfway, it feels like you're holding a bomb. But anyways, right now we're at 20 yards, so I'm gonna shoot it at 20 yards and uh, side it in all the way back to 30 and 40. The corn pile is at what? We, we're suspecting corn 25. piles at 25, so. Oh, whoa, 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 okay, we could have had big problems because what you got to keep in mind with the crossbow, whenever you let go of the arrow, these things are going to sling out and it would have slapped this right here, so. Good eyes. That's good for me, never shot a crossbow before. But same thing, because people do that all the time in trees and it like slaps the tree and it like blows up in your face. All right, it's on fire. I'm waiting for the very top one. And... I don't know where that hit, but we'll see. I'll shoot the other arrow. Consistent, that's a good thing. Yep, that's pretty good shooting right there. Well, that's very accurate, very, that's extremely accurate. Oh my Atlanta. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We may have hurt the arrow. You can't get them any closer. I think they're at a such a weird angle because we hit them. Dude, we definitely, yeah, we hit the arrow. I think we'll be all right, but yeah, we'll probably only need to shoot one at a time now. It needs to go to the right, so we'll do it clicks to the right. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and start hunting. There's the bow. Honestly, for $200, it's better than my actual bow that I paid $1,000 for. And I'm gonna be honest, it doesn't really make sense to use an actual bow whenever they make these. Unless you just, you know, like the challenge, which is, I guess, what I'm going for. All right, the broadhead we're gonna be using is this one right here. Now, it is an expandable one. Sometimes you'll wanna use an affixed broadhead, but we're gonna be using that one right there for this. Because, you know, with the field tips we were using, this is perfect for that. Plus, as fast as this is going and as strong and hard as it hits, I think this will be perfectly fine, don't you? Mm -hmm. That thing is amazing for $200. If you want to know, if you do want to buy it, it is a wild game innovations. Look up crossbow on Amazon. This one will pop up for $129. I mean, for $199. And it comes with arrows and all the stuff you've seen earlier. That there is what we're taking out. So yeah, we're going in a blind. So me and Adam's basically just got to switch to black clothes and a black mask. We'll be good to go. You ready? Ready. All right, Adam, are you ready for this? I'm ready. All right, now before we do too much, we do need to show Adam where to shoot the deer because he's not exactly sure. He keeps wanting to shoot it in the shoulder blade. Keep telling him that's not the right idea. If this is their shoulder blade, they're pretty skinny sometimes, so you can actually see where their shoulder blade is on their fur. You want to shoot right behind it because if you shoot into the shoulder blade, it's going to stick in and do nothing. It's about 520 right now, so we should have a couple hours to hunt. Yeah, that would be, be too loud. And now, guys, we're going to head on into the blind, and we'll catch you whenever we get there. All right, guys, we're about 100 yards from the blind right now, and we're going to go ahead and start being very quiet because, listen, you got to think about it. Even if there's not a deer at the feeder right now, there still may be a deer 200 yards away from the feeder coming on in. And if we just run into the stand, we could spook that deer off or at least alert them that we're there. So as we're getting close, we're going to slow down, even though there may not be a deer directly in the field, because there could be one close that we don't see. Alrighty guys, it's really cold, it's really dark, kinda. It's not super dark, we get to the point. But listen guys, within the next week, we are killing a deer with that buck, doe, something. We're killing something with a $200 crossbow. So if you wanna be sure to watch us do that, go ahead and subscribe, and I wanna see if we can get 10,000 likes on this video. But anyways guys, you officially cannot see me. Click right over here if you wanna watch a hunt video, or right over here for my entire deer hunting playlist. <laughs> Hey, Steve, you big boy. Eat some corn. Eat some corn. He don't like corn.